Hello puzzle fans, it's Fenton here with another next fest demo. This is Hourglass Prologue. Now, now then, now then. Um, kind of hate, uh, it's a strong word, I just want to get this right out of the gate, right, just straight away. Kind of hate time based puzzles where it's like, do it once with the right timing so that then you have to do it again and the right timing of the time the first time you did it lets you do it the second time so like you know pick up the box and then stand next to the thing the button that you have to put the box down on for long enough to let you go up this platform and then take it off the box so that you can put the box on the second button to go up the second platform and you know how to do it, you know exactly how to do it. It's just a, a case of. There's a massive crack in my walls. Oh, it's there! The house, the subsidence on my house is getting worse. Um, <laughs> you know how to do the puzzle. I'm just desperately like, oh my god, my house is going to fall down in the middle of this video. I don't see that happening. You know exactly how to do the puzzle, but you just. It's just timing it right. That's not a puzzle to me. So all, th all things being equal, let's go in with an open mind. This is a lot of Kickstarter backers. I wish you could just scroll through credit sequences like this. Like, who are you to say how long this credit sequence should take? Game, huh? Who are you to say that to me? What if my name begins with a Z and I wanted to show a friend of mine? Look, I'm in the credits for our, the Hourglass uh, game. It's your boy, ZZ Zop. And your friend's just like, sorry if your name begins with anything further down the alphabet than a J, you're not going to get to see it. This game saves automatically. Good. It's good. Good to know. Egypt has a capital letter, just... Man, this Arthur McConnor must be so famous! This is across the entire radio news network. Must be the Indiana Jones of this world. Look, I've even got a photo of him. That's how famous he is. I guess I'm his child. Looks nice. Can I move? Can I look? No, I can't look. I thought I could maybe look at this point, and that's why nothing was happening. Hourglass. Hourglass, not our glass. Uh, hourglass in the middle of our street. <laughs> right, uh, I can look. I can move. Presumably, I can. That's good. I can jump. I can decide it's not really worth the effort, I can get in the boat and leave. Oh, I can drown in the water, I can't swim, alright, that's good to know. Trees, statues, shadow, can't see my own feet but I can see the shadow of my feet. It's just a demo, it's just a demo. Starting off in cynical mode, clearly, but you know, it's fine. The game might be really good. Bonfires, Dark Souls, You Ignited. No? Right, fine. Alloop. No. Alloop. Lots of walking. 
button and box based gameplay. Lift slash drop cube. A little ghost there of where it's going to end up. No. Possibly. It powers the thing. It wasn't weighted, was it? It is weighted. It just also needs this. But the cube knows it's on the button. Interesting. 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 Torches. Or, uh, they're not torches, are they? What are they called when they're like this? Don't know. Wow. Wow. Wait, what? Oh no, I thought this was just the same... I thought that I'd just gone back to where I was. <laughs> Okay, fiddly jumping on boxes gameplay. Sure. I've crossed the river! I have to solve a puzzle because I can't I'll just swim and walk across it. Don't, don't be like that, don't be that guy. Why don't you just school walk across the river? Stupid game. Move the boxes. Hurry up, move the boxes. Quick. Hurry up, put the thing in the box. You stupid slaves. Is it, is it just me? Is it my eyes? Or is the gamma just uh, too high? There's no option for that. I just suddenly, like, I'm, I haven't been looking at it for the last couple of minutes, I'm suddenly just like, it's all so white! Oh, okay, right now it's blue. Okay, so this must be time. And I have a little timer here to show how long I'm going to live for as a time clone. And there's me, look, you stupid idiot. And I've stood on the button, which lets me out of the, out of the room. Alright, so far so good. We've got a button, which moves the thing. Right, already I hate it. So what I have to do now is I have to go through this and I have to imagine how long it's going to take me to walk over there and then stand on there and then press the button. And if I do that wrong... Quick, 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 go, 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 go! Oh, just about made it. Not a puzzle. Alright, what we got here? We got a weighted thing that gets this to go down. And there's a box over here. And then there's the time gate over there. So this is presumably just the reverse. So I just have to go over here and disengage the puzzle. Interact with the cube, please. Burn the box, because I hate boxes. And while I'm doing that, I can just stand over here and watch. And there's me faffing around with the controls. There's me trying to burn the box. It doesn't work. And the box stays there. Alright, okay. That's good to know, I suppose. I die. I cannot. Look, here's Icarus. 
I assume, even though that's Greek. What's he doing? Is he trying to fly, or is he just going to fan the flames? Okay, time, gate, a box that is pushing and pulling, but not spinning. But I can move it slidey sideways. Right. Oh, are you serious? Okay, so through the time gate, give myself enough time to stand on the box, slide it across. Ah, oh, end recording. No, I refuse, I'm going to jump around like an idiot. Stand on the box, wait, watch. Wonder how this could be physically interacting with the box. Try not to think too hard about it. Move on. The other thing with this is there's only two puzzles. It's do something so that your real world self can interact with it afterwards and disengage something so that your real world self cannot interact with it off before. And what I just said there was obviously complete gibberish, but you understand. So I'm interested to see exactly how they manage this. That just does the door. There's no time gate here. Oh yes there is, it's there. What does this do? How is this powered? I've run out of time. I thought maybe if it was blue it would do something in if if it's orange or blue it would do something in the different I don't have enough time to get around there, do I? This isn't a pull or a push or anything. It's just there. But it seems to be powered by this, which I don't actually know what that does. Should I have known what that does? Did it teach me that and I just forgot? Oh, it's just a button. I was looking at this. This is too distracting. This nice shiny orange spinning thing. Oh no, sorry, there is a third puzzle, which is even worse. It's the one where you have to, like, make moves because there's, like, a brick wall in the way, so you have to, like, hold forwards against a brick wall that will eventually leave and then hold forwards for long enough that you stop and then let go and stop in the right place and then like press jump and if you don't do that properly then you fail and you have to do it again I'm not going to have enough time am I? I'm not going to get there Kill, kill this. Kill this off straight away. So this is this is that though, isn't it? I have to stand here, and I have to point myself at the cube, and I have to like wait for long enough, and then click the cube, and then no, because I'm not going to get over here in time because the thing doesn't. That's not it. That's that's not the answer. Because it takes me forever to get over here. That was easy. What a ruse. I don't get back. I don't get back. I'm stuck. Kill yourself. Just resets the puzzle. Well, it puts the box back, but it doesn't actually reset the puzzle, does it? What? Now I'm definitely confused. Alright, game. I was bad mouthing you. I was bad mouthing you, game, but you actually have managed to. Uh, Alright, let's just reset it and approach it properly. Okay. Yeah, 
If I press this and go through the time gate, what happens? This happens. And then I can put this here, and that will, in fact, work. And that will interact with the box, and then I can move the platform back. Just a simple duplicating yourself. Do do two things at once. Ali oop. There's look, look there's the guy, there's the famous Indiana Jones man. He was over there. Did you see him? Did you see him? Indiana Jones. Whipless. A box. A platform. A plan. Panama. An anagram there for you, threw that in through your charge. Okay, what do we got? Does this do this one as well? No, of course not. Alright, give me the box. I need to be on there, of course. Can't jump with the box, apparently. We at least can't jump very high with the box. That's alright, I can respect that. What on earth is this for? Let's see what that does. Right, can't jump with the box, so I need to be over here without a box. That can get me the box over here. Alright, okay, good. So then my... Oh, I need this to get up the step. So then my time portal self can do this. Just leave it as long as possible. And my real self can be ready for that. I had a concept for a puzzle game like this, um, but it was a true time loop where you went into the level and your future self was solving it, or it was solving a portion of it to get you to then be your future self, and then your past self came in the room and mimicked your actions, and you had to mimic your future self's actions to keep the time loop stable. Uh, I designed four levels and then ran out of ideas and <laughs> was like, this is all you can do with that. Because the future self has to be set, it was like, eh, eh. It's a flipping pyramid. They were famous for that, weren't they, the Egypts? Good job they built a bridge, or otherwise the game would just be over right here. Ah, can't do it. Can't cross it. Can't be done. It's world-based. Look, there's going to be uh, the world of the scarab, the world of the either crocodile or alligator. I don't know which ones, which one of those is in the in the Nile, and the snake. They they loved that, didn't they? Let's find out. Let's find. Let's find out. Do Crocodiles live in the Nile. They do. But do alligators live in the Nile? A Nile crocodile. But the Nile is not a natural habit for alligators. There we go. So that's how you can remember that. You can remember it as... Nile Crocodile. Look, there's my dad! He's got Indiana Jones's hat on, but he has lost the whip. Wow. After 
wise years, I finally found it. The great gate of Egypt. Egypt has a capital letter. Talking to. I guess I'll have to find out what that means. This whole place looks like a huge mechanism, probably driven by those buttons, but only one seems to work. Great, thanks for that. Thanks for that exposition. I never would have gotten that. It's massive, isn't it? It's pretty big. Go in this water. All right, let's see what, what let's see what you got for me. It's really awkward that there's two on this side and one on this side. Like they couldn't have made it four, or just two. Two wouldn't be enough, would it? Three's the Zelda number. I don't know what I meant by that. Alright, Scarab. Going to the Scarab world. Ooh, nice. I always felt like in these... What?! Didn't see anything! Nothing happened! Didn't show me any of it. Not seeing any. I'm seeing these weird doors with mechanics. Oh, that one rewound time. Okay, well, I mean, I didn't see much, to be fair. I just saw the base mechanic, which I'd have. Uh, he's moaning me. There's his hourglass there. Oh, maybe you get you must get an item that lets you do it at will. That at least changes things slightly. Like the portal gun, I suppose. It has stationary uh, portals while you learn and then uh, lets you do it at will. Oh, I'd be interested to see exactly where this goes. Um, I will keep an eye on it. I will keep an eye on it. And I will wishlist it. There's no reason to not wishlist it. It helps the developer... And even if it, it just it is a reminder for it coming out more than anything, it's free to do, much like subscribing and liking this video. Ha ha ha. It's gone. It's gone. The whole thing's gone. Sorry, I didn't realise the game had gone when I pressed that button. I thought it would still be running in the background while I click stuff in my browser. Thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure to uh, let me know with a like or a comment. Look at me go. Look, I'm the DVD logo. Boing. Boing. And if you want to see more puzzle games in the future, boing. 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 Be sure to subscribe. Other than that, thank you so much for watching. In the corner! And I'll see you next time. Bye bye.